Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to uninstall Homebrew. So if you've installed Homebrew using my tutorial, you may at the end of the day want to remove it from your computer in order to do some testing. So I'm going to show you how to do that now. So if you'd like to uninstall Homebrew, then I'm going to leave a link to this website in the description. This is the official Homebrew GitHub page and we have instructions here for uninstalling Homebrew here. So what I'm going to do is to open up Terminal by clicking on Spotlight in the top right hand corner and then typing in the word Terminal and then pressing the first entry here. This opens up our terminal window. I'm going to press command plus to make it larger and basically what we're going to do is to copy and paste this command here. So we're going to select this code. We're going to select this code by clicking this little icon on the right of it or you can just select it and copy and then here we're going to click on the blank space and control click and then press paste and then I'm going to press return. This is asking us whether we want to remove homebrew entirely and we'll press yes. Here we're typing our password and then here we are removing our files. So saying here that some files have not been removed, this is just small preference files or things you've downloaded. So I'm just going to show you how to get rid of these files yourself. What you can do is open up Finder and then go to Macintosh HD. If you can't find the Macintosh HD line, what you can do is press go to computer and then double click on Macintosh HD. Then we need to use the keyboard shortcut command shift dot or period. So if you press command shift dot this will reveal within Finder all of the hidden files. And if I put this on the left and I put my terminal on the right, we'll be able to see what files are missing. And basically it's the opt folder here. So this is normally a hidden folder and then we have the homebrew folder here. So basically we could just remove this entire homebrew folder. The main one we need to include is basically seller. That's the thing which downloads all of the homebrew files, but that was removed in an installation. However, I'm going to fully remove this. And once I type in my password and press okay, and then I empty my bin, that will be a full uninstall of homebrew. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.